Hey guys, how are you going? My name's Michaela. I'm from Ipswich, Queensland in Australia. I am um, noticing that there's more people getting brave about admitting that they are suffering from vaginismus on uh, YouTube and uh, I'm, I'm going to join them and I'm doing this because I'm hoping to um, reach out and find some other Australian girls who are going through the same um, condition and the same journey that I'm going through. So I, I suffer from vaginismus. I have had it for seven and a half years. It happened on, well I think the beginning of it was uh, on my honeymoon. I um, developed UTI within like two days of getting married. Uh, that's a urinary tract infection and for the next three years we went to doctor after doctor. We tried every thrush and uh, UTI treatment you can imagine um, and just there was no answers at all, nothing to describe or explain the excruciating pain and um, just devastation of being unable to, to have sex with my husband the way that I wanted it to be. I have secondary vaginismus by the way, so I have had sex in the past and it was awesome and now I'm married to the man of my dreams. I, I'm not able to be with him the way that we'd like to be. So, um, so vaginismus, uh, so about after three years of this pain and discomfort, excruciating pain, um, we found a doctor who finally said the name vaginismus. And uh, my first reaction when she described it was anger because um, one of the things she said that I honed in on was that it was um, psychological and I took great offence to that because I thought she was dismissing my physical pain that is very, very real and telling me that it was all in my head. So after doing a bit of research, I understood what I was dealing with and I, I had all the symptoms and I... I understood and realised, well yes, okay, we've been waiting for this name, we, we now have vaginismus, so. Um, so, we've still been looking for answers, we have been to specialists, uh, like I said, I'm in Queensland, I have flown to Perth to see a top gyno dermatologist specialist over there, no help, um, and I have been to Adelaide to get treatment for it. Um, I, I should add that I not only have vaginismus, there is, uh, I suspect that it's probably gone to vulvodynia now, and uh, also the main problem that I have at this point, we think we've got the solution for the vaginismus side, it's the super infection that I'm having, so every time for no reason, um, I just get infected and, and it's really painful, burning pee, um, uh, itchy, red raw uh, and, and you know a lot of discharge and it can be smelly and yucky. So um, yeah, um, so the reason I'm here today telling you all this in incredibly personal stuff is because I'm sick of being alone in this. I know I'm not alone, but I feel lonely because I don't know anyone else who's in the same boat as me. I know you're out there. So um, I have started a Facebook page today. It's called uh, Vaginus Miss Down Under because I am hoping to meet other females in Australia who are suffering from this condition. Uh, and I will include my email at the bottom of this video clip, which is also called Vaginismus Down Under. It's a play on words. Did you get it? Australia and down there. Yeah, so I thought it was clever. Uh, yeah, so anyway, look, I'm, I'm sick of being quiet about it. I'm sick of being alone in it. Um, yeah, I just want to meet other people who understand what I'm going through and, and form a support group. And in that support group, we might have methods or doctors that have helped us and maybe share that information with each other. But most of all, just to share the, to share the burden of it. It is incredibly frustrating and lonely and, and 
depressing. I mean, I've gone through episodes of depression with this because it's questioning my identity as a female and, and as a wife and as a woman to not be able to have pain-free, enjoyable sex. And if you're in the same boat as me, you know what I'm talking about. So please email me, please join my Facebook page and um, let's, let's be in the same boat together and, and support each other through this because it's bloody hard. Thanks guys, I hope I hear from you. Bye.